Hello everybody and welcome back to my space journey in No Man's Sky. We are at episode 5 already and we have quite a lot of things to complete. As you can see, the base, even though it's rather small, is coming nicely. And we need to do, actually, we need to complete a few things that we left from the previous episode. And that is hiring a base armorer. Where is he? Where is he? Oh yeah, this is uh, this is the mission that I'm talking about. And of course, we also need to scan a few animals for our scientists. So I thought, why not do that in a different system? And I think that is gonna be the start of this episode. We're going to travel really fast to a fresh new system and see what we have over there. So luckily, because we went on Atlas Path, you know, the journey that we still need to complete, we have enough power cells to do that. So luckily for us, but... Let's see, do we find a viking system? And more importantly, can we get there? Oh, there's two viking over here. This is rather close, has three planets with uh, one of them having one moon. And this one has way more planets. And it is still a viking, so let's go there. I want it to be like a huge system, so my chances of finding something interesting increase. Still, I see you guys enjoyed the previous video. I'm so happy that you guys liked it so much, but here we are. Um, this looks like it's a lava-filled planet, but uh, something tells me that it's gonna change once we get there. It's still a torrid planet. Let's see what kind of things do we have around here. I'm really curious, honestly. We're also going to go on the space station nonetheless. Desolate planet. <laughs> so this is like a dead waste. A lifeless planet. Well, let's just go on the desolated one over here because it looks so freaking interesting. If I'm going to find lava, it's gonna be a dream come true for me. Like, I just want to see a full planet covered with volcanoes erupting. That would be, like, the most amazing experience ever. But I guess this one will do, and I have to say it looks impressive. Fauna is rather medium, flora is abundant. So let's see, where will we find some animals? I'm seeing some scanners indicate life is in that direction. Hopefully it won't kill us, it won't attack us, it won't devour us. Because in the previous episode we had such big problems with, you know, all sorts of creatures and all sorts of beings trying to kill us, you know, entities. You know, even though it was robotic entities, aka the sentinels trying to get our heads. Oh wow. What is this thing? Looks like a <laughs> trollium... Uh, I'm not gonna attempt to even, you know... Wow, this uh, this place is actually full. Holy shit, stacks. That looks so freaking interesting. Oh, we even have, like, small puny creatures. Oh, that is so cute. Oh, there's those pesky drones. God, I hate them so much. Why won't, why won't you leave me alone already? You're always just always in my back, never leaving me alone. Well, this is actually interesting. We, we even found a signal thingy, uh, build, base, whatever. It's something. But I want to check this thing out. Ooh, look at you. You're so majestic. You have six legs, actually. And a fish tail. And spikes on your back. Are you scared of me? How is it? It's a passive creature. Well, that's, uh, that's a good thing to hear, but it is so amazingly good looking. Nonetheless, now that we're done with that, you know, just taking screenshots, I want to see what's here. Can we find something interesting? Ooh, hey, well, well, well. What is this thing? It's, it's a traveler like us. Oh, I want to take a, I want to take a selfie with this thing. Oh, it's so cute. It looks like Ant-Man. Well, you know, if Ant-Man was... You know, completely messed up. Let's talk to this thing. Corrupted, corrupted, corrupted. Take, please, file proof we existed. Ooh. Um, stay with stay with him until the end. Ask what is happening as a stranger's name. I'm gonna stay with you until the end. The life and the universe are consumed in a blaze of white. And yet the life form is still here, apparently unaware of anything that just occurred. As I leave, they ask if I have received any troubling readings. They are afraid something is happening to their world. Oh, wow. That is so interesting. Where did he come from, though? If it's if, if that, that is not his real form... I think this is the correct one. 
Okay, <laughs> that was easy. Um, standing with the Viking has increased. What did we find though? Oh, just a monolith. And it's all, no, a ruin and it's off planet. Oh well, just my luck. Still, this is a nice looking planet and this view is amazing. What we need is a little bit of resources. Unfortunately, this planet looks kind of dull. Doesn't really seem to have much. I also need to scan these things. Oh yeah, give me units, baby. Make me rich. That is exactly what I need right now. I need a lot of money. I'm actually trying to gather more money for a proper ship. A, it may be a freighter. That would be a cool thing to get. But this is a transmission tower as a matter of fact. And I think it's going to be useful for us to see what it has. Oh yeah. Oh. Come to daddy. Oh, it seems to be abandoned. Just my luck. And I'm not finding more like multi-tools. That would be something that I really wish to see. So let's see, um, I think 720 is the, is the answer over here. I have done these so many times, I know them, you know, by heart. Oh, and I think we just found the crash ship. Look at that beautiful terrain, by the way. It's rather close by. Okay, let's go to the crash ship. It better be better than mine. I would be so pleased if that was the case. If not, uh, well, we're just gonna resume our journey. Was it really this close? Oh. What? <laughs> what the f What the hell? Wow, this is the perfect spot to to put your ship on. Will it Will it drop if I if I destroy the tree? There's nobody in the universe better at parking than I am. Oh yes. Come on. <laughs> it looks like it's shaking. Oh, it's the tree that's shaking, but I'm not, I don't think it's going to fall. Okay, so it's gonna be a problem if I won't be able to reach it. Oh, yeah. Uh, still, though. Oh, my God. Look at this other beauty. Wow, this is... This is not just any ship. This is a hauler. Let's see how many slots it has. Hopefully, it has some active... Oh, well. It's a 30-slot B-grade ship. I need this. Oh, I need this so badly. Oh, but I just forgot that my hyperdrive... Oh, my hyperdrive is active. But I want this ship so badly. And luckily that one will be stuck over there. We don't need it anymore. Who cares about it? Um, let's repair the pulse engine. Let's repair... We're gonna need a lot of iron, aren't we? Yeah, we need... It. Luckily I have enough antimatter. I'm just gonna go farm a little bit. What is over here, by the way? Will we receive something interesting? I want a new multi-tool or maybe a blueprint. S send out warning signal. Search ship for signs of life. Is there maybe maybe there's somebody alive? Okay, accelerator. Accelerated fire sigma. Eh. Can't say I'm too eager about that. Okay, let's let's get some of this iron. Make some carrot sheets. And repair this spaceship and just be on. I, I just like how it looks, honestly. It looks so freaking dope. I mean, I always wanted a hauler like that. You know, a dropship. But we will get it soon enough. We just need to repair its uh, broken pieces. Luckily, we have all of the resources that we need on this very planet. Uh, one of those again. It, uh, whatever, I'm gonna just go farm the iridium. Oh, it's, it's getting night and the temperature seems to be dropping just in time because I was melting. I'm gonna farm as much as possible, like 250 is what we need. Uh, I think I think this should be enough. I think we can repair it soon. I think we need... Oh, we need a dynamic resonator. Can we build a dynamic... Or I will just buy it if I can't build it. Chrysonite. I think I'm gonna just buy it. Not a problem. I have enough money. Huh. <laughs> finally 68.8 degrees celsius in theory you should slowly cook at this temperature if it if it ever happened on earth but we have our exosuit which is more than enough to protect us luckily because otherwise i would have no idea what i would even do i would just melt to death probably oh come on dude leave me alone his aim is so bad oh my god it's two of them no <laughs> no Please, I'm innocent. Okay, 
Oh, he's calling his friends? We must not let him call his friends. Well, just my luck, no free slots. But uh, we managed in the end, and now I'm gonna repair this. And pretty much everything that I need is repaired. So we are here with our beautiful new spaceship. It's a hauler, it is rather big. And look at these beautiful knights. Oh, this is so pretty. Ah. <sighs> This is relaxing. Okay, let's just go to the space station. And I'm going to try to recruit an armorer because he will give us the long needed hazmat suit. I mean hazmat gauntlet. And we're going to be able to finally gather those resources that we weren't able to do before. So I'm glad we came here. We got a beautiful ship. We're gonna recruit a third person in our beautiful base on our beautiful lush paradise. Life is finally looking up for us. Look at this beauty. It even has, you know, like that little thing over there. You can shoot things with it. I have balls. I like the color scheme of this ship so much. It looks so pretty. So let's see. What do we have here? We have a bunch of these dudes. Oh, this dude looks so cool with his horns. So this is our new armorer and I'm going to hire his services. Welcome aboard, dude. Enjoy your stay. We're probably gonna get some of the missions so we can, you know, do things that it requires us to do. Okay, let's see, what do we need? Eliminate sentinels, we're gonna probably do that. Exterminate planetary creatures, I'm also gonna do that. You know, I'm just gonna grab all the missions in bulk. And we're gonna probably complete them as we journey ahead. Hunt low-level pirates, we also have some of those. We had them in the last episode, they always come in the worst possible moment. Yeah, so let's get back to our beautiful planet and we're going to do the missions that follow. Stellar Afraid? What? Return to your ship and leave the station? What? Why would I do that? Why does it require me to... Oh, Agricultural Terminal. Uh, I'm not sure what the game is requiring me to do. I have never seen this before. What we got? Where's the armorer? Here he is. What's up, my dude? Accept the gauntlets. Oh, thank you very much. We will need some iridium, plutonium, platinum. That is inexpensive, as a matter of fact. There's some kind of mission over there. Whatever, let's, let's go. It seems that it requires me to steal some industrial secrets. I have no idea what that even means. I didn't even know that I can do that in No Man's Sky. I hope there's not something that's gonna wait for me over there and kill me as I exit. Pirates! Okay. Okay, we have enough weapons. Let's kill! He is... 6 seconds ahead of us. Oh, he's so dead. Come on, babe. He's doing more damage than I can do. I'm not gonna leave him be. Die! What is this? Yes! I'm melting him! Come on, a little bit. Yes! Well, this was super easy, dude. And we got his loot. Nicely done! Well, well, well. That was the only reason why I needed to do that, to intercept that guy. I'm going to farm a little bit of platinum because I cannot buy it, you know, I need to take it. I think there's plenty on my starting planet. Scientific re Oh yeah, return to the scientist. I almost forgot about this dude. How could I have forgotten about my trusty scientist? Hey man, I got your stuff. Look how happy it is. Oh, he's so happy. And he gave us unstable gel. Okay, I think it's gonna be useful later on. Shielding shards. Wait, hold on a minute. Oh, this is the shielding shard. God damn it. This was... Oh, I need... I still need platinum, though. <laughs> so, I'm, wherever I'm going, I'm gonna take more platinum. Shut down the weapon factory. Let's see. Where's the, where's the weapon factory? There it is. Let's go, baby. Let's shut down the weapon factory. Kill whatever is there. Nobody messes with me and my uh, weapon specialist, scientist thing. It is within reach. It's on that small island. Oh, never mind. It's not on the small island. It's just that it they form in front of me. But it looks like it's a lagoon. And it seems to be connected. Which means that I'm going to be able to 
farm a little bit over there. Maybe we find something interesting. That would be amazing. Where's the entrance? Oh, there it is. Oh, yeah. And there's security over here, though it is not heavy. You know what? I'm gonna need to take these guys down. While he's not looking. Like, I shot him like 10 times before he even noticed me. Okay, this is not gonna be feasible. I'm gonna need to destroy this thing before it. Because they will spawn uncontrollably. Holy hell. Come on. I can take this damage. Oh no. They have such good aim. Bust up. Oh shit. All the alarms are on. Come on. Come on. Disable it. Override procedure. Productions. I don't care. Oh. Whew. Jesus Christ. Okay, you can scan me only one, dude. I have one. It is me. I'm gonna scan you back for this. Okay, that was intense. We need to go back now. Oh, wait. Hold on a minute. I said I'm here for something else as well. Now look at this beautiful ocean view. Isn't the water just beautiful? Yes! Platinum! Exactly what we needed. Though it's not that much. We need a little bit more than that. That will not suffice. Uh-oh, something's attacking me. He sees me. This thing is unpredictable. Okay, man. Oh my god. Oh my god, he's, he's charging towards me. Jesus Christ. Dude. Dude. Oh my god. Why will he leave me alone? Attack something else. There's full of animals over here. And he... Oh yeah. He just goes for another animal. He's so unpredictable. Jesus. Well, at least he's not my problem now. I think I have enough platinum right now. Okay, let's call our spaceship. I'm gonna go on a rather high point so it can come easily towards me. Okay, this is a bad spot. Where is it? Oh, there it is. Hey, don't drop on me, dude. Holy hell. <laughs> it was just like... Poof. It was just like that. Let's just jump into it. Um, Let's see. I think we have enough for the gauntlet. Oh, here you are. Oh, you beauty. Hazmat gauntlet. And I think we're done with both of those quests at the same time. And we will arrive in like a few seconds. There it is. I really need to build like a landing platform over here. It's obviously that we need it. Let's give it to our armor really quick. I got you what you want. Confirm. Ooh, Cyclotron Ballista. Okay, so I need to kill... Okay, he wants me to fight pirate ships. That is good, because I will also need to fight pirate ships for a different mission. But in the meantime, we also have to talk to our scientist. Hello, my man. Take it. Nice. Polyfiber. Okay, what do we need? We need a monolith. So we will take a monolith soon enough, but we need to go into space and kill a bunch of pirates. I'm gonna put a holler to the test, actually. Space pirates are waiting us. Yeah, let's fight, baby. Where are you at? Where are you at? Oh, is that so? You wanna do it from below? Oh, he's so dead. He's fighting a losing battle, though. Wow, this was super easy. <laughs> he was following me from down there, wasn't he? He was trying to find me. That sucks for him too much. But now I'm going to go and complete the scientist mission. Well, oh, oh, a little bit clunky. But we made it. Within the trees. Yeah, there's just a bunch of animals. Hopefully I didn't step on any of you guys. I totally did. I totally killed a bunch of animals by landing on them with my ship. Oh my god, PETA better not be coming on my ass. Okay, let's go. Okay, a bunch of text. Ooh. This is a, the most interesting monolith I have ever seen in my whole life. I'm definitely going to find some squished animals underneath my ship. This is gonna need so much cleaning now. I'm just going to go on the previous system and we're gonna gather some solanium. We're gonna use that to give it to our supervisor or, you know, the guy that supervises our base. 
So let us see. There's a base over here, actually. Let's land over here. Let's see, do we find something in this base? Ooh. Okay. There is someone here. Oh, wow. Look at this beauty. Holy hell. It's only 2 million units. How am I going to afford this? It has everything it needs, even terrain manipulator. Yes. Why? I want it so badly. Okay, kind sir, what do you have for me? Sheer oxygen. The warrior takes some gulp from my respiration system. Their eyes brighten and they thank me. Really? 560 units? I could have made more if I just went outside and mined something randomly. I I'm a millionaire, okay? I don't need... 560 units. I'm gonna mine y'all. I'm gonna mine you slowly. Because I need this plutonium. And I'm seeing some solanium over there. I think I, I had a glimpse of solanium really close. Wait a minute. Something just ran away in that direction. I'm seeing a lot over here. This, these three vines will give me 150. Let's see. What do we need to do now? We need to go planetary base, return to the overseer. Yes, we will do that. Back again. Okay, Master Chang, I brought you your solanium. Thank you very much. If you are kind enough to take it so I can free my inventory. Agricultural terminal. And we can finally extend our base. So let's build. Let's see, how do we build this? Can I make three rooms over here? So I'm going to put in. Do I have the square one? I don't need. This. I don't think I have the square one. Okay, it is there. I'm probably gonna build my room on top of this so I can see things from up. But uh, this is going to be our agricultural terminal, and we can finally start setting up plants and everything. I'm also going to put in the exocraft thingy. We're gonna need that. So I'm going to do just that. And bam, it's up there. Now what we need is a bunch of stairs. We don't have any stairs, do we? Okay, and there it is. This is going to be the room for our other scientist, which is going to be the specialist terminal. And we can recruit a specialist as well, and we can finally build some exocrafts. Let's uh, make the introductions. This is our new farmer guy. Let's see. What mission does he have for us? Oh, nice. Copyright flower. Um, we also have our technician up there. He's also gonna give us... Where is he? There he is. I hope you don't fall into that pit, dude. I'm sorry if that is gonna happen. I know you're mad because I've put you in this. Like, not the best room. Accept. Build Roamer Geobay. Voltaic cell, dynamic resonator. I want to build it. I want to start the next episode with a Geobay constructed. But this is our base right now. This is what we have accomplished in this episode. And more is to come. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. As always, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. If you did, if you didn't, you're free to just leave a dislike. I'm gonna put an end to this episode. And I will see you guys in the next one.